ग्रीटिंग्स एंड गुड मॉर्निंग आई एम पलियापन असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ बयोकेमिस्ट्री जे जे कॉलेज ऑफ आर्ट्स एंड सैंस अटानामोटे ई टॉक अबउट आंटीबयोटिक प्रोडक्शन आंटीबयोटिक्स और आंटी मैक्रोबियल एजेंट प्रोड्यूस नेचुरली बै अदर मैक्रोब्स यूजली फंग आर बैक्टीरिया The first antibiotic was discovered in 1896 by Ensert, Tachisnans, and rediscovered by Alexander Fleming in 1928 from the Flemingus fungus of Penicillium notatum. The antibiotic substance named penicillin was not verified until the 1940s by Flory and Chain. just to be used for the end of second world war the penicillin was the first important commercial commercial product produced by an aerobic submersed fermentation the antibiotic can be selectively toxic by targeted targeting such features such as bacterial cell wall and sementinous ribosome an enzyme that are specific to bacteria this is way to human eukaryotic cells are not unaffected for example the penicillin ampicillin amoxicillin methicillin in incubate the enzyme involve the synthesis of peptoglycan of bacterial cell wall causing the cell lysis the cell lysis is nothing but the breakdown of bacterial cell wall a degraded bacterial cell wall that is known as bacteriocidal bacteriocidal the narrow spectrum little effect of gram negative back cells the other antibiotic may affect cell membrane dna replication and transcription and translation the antibiotic production there are over 10000 different antibiotics now but only about 200 in commercial use since most new antibiotics are on better the existing one there is a constant search for new antibiotic antibiotics are most prescribed drugs and are a big business uh, finding a new antibiotic and getting on the market is very long process it can takes 15 years the production method of antibiotics the antibiotics are produced on the industrial scale using the variety of fungus and bacteria the penicillin is produced by the fungus of penicill 